Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing another plan with me. I'm going to plan the month of November as well as the week of November 11th through the 17th. Um, I know I probably should have done the month of November last week, but I just, I didn't film last week. <laughs> Uh, as you probably know because there's not a video on the channel. Um, but anyway, so I didn't film last week so I figured I'd go ahead and do the monthly because I do want to get it in the planner um, and then also do the week. So um, I guess I could have opened up on the actual month but whatever. We'll go, <laughs> we'll go through the stickers once we, um, you know, get around to doing the week itself. Okay, so for the month of November, I'm actually going to use the EC kit that I have that corresponds with the Thanksgiving set in the Celebrations collection. Um, I lately have been doing like a custom sheet for myself, but I just went ahead and printed the one that's actually on the website. So, uh, like the previous months, I am going to glue this to here. The last two months, I have actually used a repositionable adhesive. This month, I have decided I don't need repositionable, and I am going with ooh, and I'm going with the permanent adhesive from Tombow. So, hopefully, I don't screw it up. <laughs> Um, so first I'm going to glue that together, then I am using the Monday through Sunday, so I have to change this to a Monday start, and so I have here, so I have some number stickers that are also available on the site. Um, like I said, normally I've been doing this like custom, like for October for example, I had these numbers and then like I had this little birthday sign and all of that. Um, this one doesn't have that because this is just the one that's on the website and I haven't updated this sheet in a while. And so I just printed out, we do have this sheet on the site. So I just grabbed both of these and I will switch this to a Monday start and then add everything in. Hopefully I remember this stuff. Maybe I should write the dates. Now I have the dates so I won't hopefully <laughs> screw that up. Um, actually maybe I should leave them here for now. Okay. I'm going to be all over the place in this video, just so you know. <laughs> I still have my gorgeous pumpkin cover on. I would probably leave this cover on my planner forever if I could. I mean, I guess technically I can, but it doesn't really make sense. So, tweezers. Okay, let's see. So... I'm going to pull up another calendar so that I don't screw this up because I am like all over the place. Okay, so now that the numbers are down, I'm going to white out the extra numbers. I'm not going to white out the holidays yet because I want to make sure I put them on the correct date. So let's see. So I'm going to grab the holidays from here. This is the collection that has been discontinued. Cover. Oh, you couldn't even see what I was doing. I stuck that there to cover up the um, hexagon. And then let's see. So we have Thanksgiving. Okay, so then, so that's all the ones that are listed in there. So now, let's see, um, I already put a Thanksgiving one down, so I don't need that one. And then, okay, so November 13th. Hey, that's this week. World Kindness Day. And then we have Pink Friday. So for those of you who may be new to Chrissy Ann Designs, we do an event on Black Friday, and we call it Pink Friday because our color is pink. So we've been doing that for 
four, five years now. I don't know. I don't remember exactly. Um, so yeah, if you're not on our mailing list, you should probably sign up before then because you will get information about Pink Friday soon, actually. Um, so yeah, that's all the holidays. And now, okay, so here is the Thanksgiving um, sheet. I'm just gonna take it out of the planner. Er, I'm gonna take it out of the binder, okay. I think I'm gonna leave the rest of these for when I do Thanksgiving week. So now I guess the monthly is all done. Super simple. I don't really do much in the monthlies. Um, super simple, done. Now we're going to go, oh, you know what? I didn't glue these sheets together. I should do that. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Boom. Oh yeah, I really like how that one feels. The other ones I can kind of like, kind of feel them wanting to come apart. This does not feel like it wants to come apart, so that's nice. Awesome, okay. Um, also, if you're looking for like a tip on how to glue these together, um, it can be a little difficult, especially if you try to line the edges up because the edges aren't always cut exactly straight. Um, but the best way I have found is to actually try to line it up with the coils so that there's no overlapping here and then that gives you the best lines over here. Because I mean, if you think about it, like when everything is lined up on the coils, everything is lined up on the coils. <laughs> so, um, so yeah. So that is the month of November. Very simple, but done. So now we will go to the week, which is this one. Okay, so for this week, it is actually supposed to be a very cold week in Houston. Um, very cold, like <laughs> some of you probably live in places where it's much colder, but it's going to be very cold here uh, early on in the week. So I decided to use our new Cuddle Up collection. So this one came out last Friday. Um, and it is, it features artwork from the talented Shauna Klingerman, who has done some work with us in the past. I absolutely love her aesthetic, her style, how, like, her art, everything. She is, like, so talented. So I'm really excited to use this one. Um, I was going to save it for December, but since this week is supposed to be so cold and I didn't really have a set that I really wanted to use, so I'm going to use this one. So I've got the decorative stickers, and then I have, I'm so obsessed with how this one came out. Um, she gave all the little critters, and I decided that I wanted them like on the strip, and so I'm super excited for that. Uh, so that's the date cover decoration. Then we have the weekly set that just has a bunch of functional items on it, some functional boxes, and then these are the sheets from the actual kit. So the checklists with some snowflakes on the background, the really cute decoration boxes. This is the functional sheet and date covers, more functional boxes, and then more functional items with some lettering. So those are all the stickers um, I'm going to use, which I'm sure it was not a surprise. I'm gonna use this one on the bottom, um, but I think I'm actually going to Am I going to use, I don't know if I want to use these date covers or if I want to use these. I think I'm actually going to go with these. Yeah. No. What do I want to do? No, I'm going to go with these. Um, <laughs> so I'm going to use this whole sheet for this. Um, I am going to use these numbers though instead of these ones. I just feel like it. And I am going to color block the columns again, like I have done the last few weeks because I really like how it turns out. So I'm gonna start with putting this down and then we'll go from there.
All right, so now that that is all set, I don't want to forget to put uh, the Veterans Day sticker down. So I have this book from our Michaels collection. So this one isn't in stores anymore, um, but it's like one of my favorite books. So <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, let's see, I want to use this, but I think I want to layer it on an actual box, so now I have to figure out. I'm gonna set that one aside, I guess. I'm gonna do this like I did the Halloween week where I had um, checklists at the top and then some decorative stickers in the middle. So Monday is gonna be, no wait, I want Tuesday to be this color because Tuesday is supposed to be like really cold, so I wanna use that one. It's really funny using this when like technically we're still in fall, but I just love this kit so much. Okay, so we're gonna go blue, then pink. So we're gonna go cuddle up first. Actually, let's do it this way. Let's put them like that so I can bring them. Ooh. You know, I originally wanted to put this one on Tuesday, but Tuesday they're like saying it's possibly gonna snow in the morning. So maybe we'll do that. I know, that sounds really weird. Someone in Houston saying it's gonna snow, but. And obviously I'm able to, <laughs> to lay these down like this because they are repositionable. I'm gonna use this one. So basically, this is just me like deciding if this is the order I want them in. So yeah, there. I think I like that. I'm just gonna leave it like that. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> now I can put them down. This little guy, he's seriously so cute. Look at his nose. His... Oh, I love these. And now that I have them sitting like this, I feel like I'm actually gonna swap this one with the Hello Winter, just so that there's not two critters right next to each other. You know, I feel like by the end of the week, it's supposed to be warm again, but so cute, so cute. Okay. So then we have the weekend. Okay, so on, I'm, I'm gonna start like doing the actual plans now. For this sidebar, so I could do winter time. Actually, that looks really cute. Oh my gosh, I stuck it on the wrong color. What am I doing? I've been looking at the wrong one this whole time. Okay, so. Pink is what we're looking for. <laughs> Goodness. Okay. And then the EC Seasonal Surprise Box comes out on Monday and I'm gonna get it. Are you getting it? Or by, this, by the time you watch this, have you already gotten it? Um, I have gotten all but one of the seasonal surprise boxes. And even though most of the time I like give away or sell some of the pieces, there's always at least one thing that makes the box worth it for me. So I'm getting it. <laughs> I have no clue what's in it. On this one, I want to use a square shape box. And then Tuesday night is going to be when I am editing this video. So, so I have these here. And he's the same guy as this one. So I kind of want to change him out. But who do I want to change them for? I 
It doesn't quite cover it, but it's close, so it totally works. Um, and obviously not a huge deal, but it's the same guy. And I have like all of these decorations, so might as well. Right? That's how I look at it anyway. Okay, and then... Basically, I'm gonna come up and fill in these checklists later, but I wanna get like the main stuff, so. Here, normally I work from home on Thursdays, but we are going to go to, um, we're gonna go to a market, the Nutcracker Market, Nutcracker Ballet Market, I think actually is what it's called. Um, which is like, um, you know, a giant holiday market and they're open all weekend, but I don't really like crowds and I know it's going to be busy Saturday and Sunday, Friday we have new releases. So Thursday is the best day to go for us. So I'm trying to decide which sticker to use. Normally I use a straight edge for cutting, but I don't have one handy. So my cuts aren't perfect. And I don't know what time it is. Oh, it's from 8.30 to 5. Okay, so they are open from 10 to 8. So I imagine we will probably go like noonish. So I'm gonna be bold and I'm gonna just write like noon to three. <laughs> I don't know how long we'll be there, but that is what I'm gonna write down. And hopefully that's correct. And if it's not, then I'll deal with it later. <laughs> I'm gonna use this one, I'm gonna put it sideways, and then I'm gonna cover up those ice skates. And in case you have been patiently waiting for either the Hanukkah coordinating collection or the winter coordinating collection with the celebrations collection, those will be out on Friday. <clears throat> then Saturday, I don't think I have anything um, planned just yet. So uh, Sunday, I'm going to film a plan with me. And I'm going to use these little guys from Fox and Cactus. <clears throat> Saturday, I'm not sure what we're gonna do, so I'm gonna leave that one blank. So that's all of that. Now I just have to put in all of the checklist items. Also, um, I've been getting a lot of questions lately about, or questions, comments, everything about my nails. Um, a few months ago, <laughs> I got obsessed with these nails from Red Aspen. I've been buying them from Carrie, I Heart to Plan on Instagram. And I think I'm finally going to sign up to sell them. So I wrote that down for Monday. Um, so if I do, I will, well, either way, I'll put information in the description below. But if you are also interested in these nails, you should take a look. They are literally amazing. I love them. Um, I like having different color nails and I don't like having to paint them because I always chip them and all of that. These colors last for usually up to two weeks. I sometimes will not put as, because they're, they're press on nails. I sometimes won't put as much glue because I know I'm gonna wanna change them out again. So that is also really nice, but I really like them. So I'll leave some information in the description in case you want to check them out. Okay. So I just kind of went through that easily um, because, I mean, it's just a to-do list. So for the side here, I think I'm actually going to use the other piece of this. So this was this one here. 
And I will just stick this down to add some pictures. Um, and I am going to, I wrote it on my list, I'm going to work on printing out all the pictures that I haven't done for previous weeks and I'm gonna put those down. So I might film putting those down, I might not. Um, but I have had some questions about the actual, like, the actual pictures that I do. So I might do a little video, like, talking about how I do my, my pictures and all of that. Um, I haven't really decided, but that's, like, kind of what I think is going to make the most sense, especially since I have so many to put down, because it's been a few weeks since I've done it. Ugh, that's a lie. It's probably been, like, a month. <laughs> um, but... So I thought that that might be, since people keep asking about it, I thought that that might be like a good thing to do. But anyway, so um, this is my week. I really, really, really like how it turned out. Um, so thank you so much for spending your time with me and watching this video. I do hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos like it, please hit that subscribe button, and I hope to see you next time. Bye.